we have to talk about your hair and your makeup and the prosthetics. <laughs> yeah. What is the worst and best part of, you know, sitting in that chair? How long did it take? Talk about your experience well, with that. Well, uh, three hours is, is how long it, it, it takes. Although mm -hmm. Sophia likes to say it, it takes longer, but it's, she's like. <laughs> <laughs> um, it, the best thing about it was that I got to wear it and I got to just really become a completely different person. <laughs> And a different being as well. And the worst thing about it is that I had to become a completely different being because the, the whole process, although it's quite calm actually, putting all putting the, the prosthetic out of prosthetic, you know, it's the wig, the beard, and the beard comes in like 16 different parts. So it's a you know, it's a, it's a process, but it's quite a calming process. It's throughout the day that it's 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 quite difficult. But see, I, I mean, I love to complain about it. And these guys are oh, used, oh, yeah. oh, yeah. used to complaining about it. <laughs> Tell us all night. But secretly, I absolutely love it. I love that I get to be different to, to, to how I look from day to day. <clears throat> well, we had, we had the feet. So it's not quite as, it wasn't, it, we kind of had, it, I guess, the easiest out of all the prosthetics. I think the orcs had the longest time that mm -hmm. they had to get ready. Um, and then for sure the dwarves. But I feel like we, we yeah, we were slipping around in 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 big flippers that went up to our knees <laughs> and like pulling, you know, holding each other up. And it was, I guess, the deliriousness of that at like three in the morning of a night shoot in the middle of, you know, this huge forest kind of singing Proud Mary and walking in these, <laughs> walking in these huge hearts. It's, it's like, it's okay feet. to wear it. Like when you put it on, it's like, oh, this is oh, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's the length of time the that length you wear time. it for. That's, it's your that's... bathroom store. The costumes are incredible. Is there a memorable moment? I mean, did anybody's costume take longer? Um, prosthetics, maybe. <laughs> um, maybe heavy armor. What were these experiences like for you guys, if anybody wants to? I really enjoyed my journey, actually. And um, Kate Hawley is a formidable um, woman and talent and was the perfect beginning for this show perfect she she is a scholar she is a divine mind and and there was absolutely not one iota of dust that was for nothing on anyone's costume and so um to to kind of go on that journey with her particularly creating a character that we've not necessarily seen in in, in on this scale before um was unbelievable. She, she, we actually started off with a costume that was much more heavy set. It was kind of quite structured and sculptured, and 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 then we just said, and then and then Kate Hawley, we, we spent a few weeks on that, and then at one point she just said, "What if, what if Disa was really sexy? Hmm. What if she had an unapologetic version of herself that we can just display? What if?" we put a great big gaping split that goes to the top of the thigh. And that actually, in and amongst so much um, earthy strength and rock, that we have her as kind of the water that runs mm. across all of that. And thus that costume was born. Were the sets intimidating to any of you guys? Or is it was it an exciting experience? I, I think, I mean, intimidating... No, they were humbling, I think. Mm -hmm. I, I think as actors, the, the it was such a treasure. I remember walking to uh, the Southlands for the first time and understanding that I, I, mean, I had never done this before. I've been, uh, or never been in, a, in an environment like that before. I've been acting for like 20 years. That it was a 360 environment created for, for, for us, for me, for my character. Um, and that you were able to step into a different layer of performance because you didn't have to really imagine much people keep asking us about green screen mm. there wasn't a lot yeah. this was everything cool. was created the yeah. mythology like even in things that you will never see like a column <clears throat> behind a column there's a there was an inscription there was a hieroglyph that told the story oh. of even in our costumes it was the same thing layers under layers that were never going to be seen were like meticulously created so these sets I think yeah. are as much part of our performance as what we brought. Hey guys, we got a new show on the E! News YouTube channel all about celebrities and their cars. It's called Drive, and you can check out the first episode with NASCAR champion Joey Logano right here. And don't forget to come back every Monday for all new episodes.